Hello. 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 Welcome back. Week two of the sewing bee. I know, and we have another guest in tonight. <laughs> this is tonight, Mandy, today. our knitting guru, on camera for the first time. And, uh, and sitting knitting. <laughs> yeah. Unexpected. Who watched it, didn't you? Yes, I did yeah. watch it. After last week's chat, I thought. Yeah, let's see what this is about. <laughs> yeah, it's good fun. It's good fun. So we've got, and uh, Ting's back as well. So uh, if you didn't Yay. watch it, then hopefully over the next half hour, we'll get you up to date with week two, which was Children's Week. Yes. It was quite a fun week this week. It was really And good. I want to make a hoodie. Yeah. Just saying. I think we all do, don't we? <laughs> yeah. 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 I, I, I live on hoodies, though. Because like, any time I go exercise and I don't, I have a hoodie all of the time. Do you have the like the proper thick like super dry hoodies or have yours I have like both. the thin? Ah. I've got the cozy yeah. ones and then the lighter ones yes. for when I'm working yeah. out and I don't want to sweat too yeah. much. In like proper Rocky style. Yeah. <laughs> Ting, you need yes, a hoodie? Uh, yeah, I've got my hoodie over yeah. there actually. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We have yeah. a hoodie up here as yeah. well. I, well I go for two types but I actually prefer the thinner, thinner one so that's an All Saints one, you know the thin merino, really yeah. nice. But we are filming again. Um, if customers come in, I will dash off. Yeah. It was quite sad, actually, wasn't it? Because we we said that on the first episode, <laughs> and nobody came in. Nobody yeah. came. We had you had a busy film. morning that time, so. Yes. But we are also so. filming this in the morning when it can be quite busy. Touch wood. Touch wood. Okay, let's get on. Yeah. So uh, let's talk about the uh, the pattern challenge, which was the hoodie, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. I thought it was really good. There was some I I really liked. Um, Leah's with the sharks yeah and they didn't mention her pattern matching I thought that was incredible where she matched the fin onto the end of the shark and stuff yeah I think Janet got a lot of the the pattern matching compliments there didn't yeah she, with her and I was like Leah's yeah, definitely think, pattern matched I think the the shark pattern you could it wasn't as obvious yeah right. But it was um, because it, it was only was like, it was only a little fin where the bunny well, was, had its head cut in half but there was the, a little fin and there was two bits of pattern matching with Leah's yeah. And I thought that was more impressive because it's the finer detail. Mm -hmm. Whereas like half a bunny face, you can kind of go, it's round, you're going to go halfway. Yes, I suppose. But that was just me. But there was also some people who had chosen some fabrics that were patterned that didn't match it. Yeah, yeah. like Ricardo. Yeah. 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 Him and his triangles. Yeah. What do you think of the much? choice of fabrics? Because I know with with sweatshirt material, you know, there there is a big choice, isn't there? For, uh, you know, mm -hmm. of prints or stripes or... Yeah. Do you I think liked... anyone chose particular fabrics and, and then did a better job because of the choice of fabrics. Was it Janet who made it for her grandchildren? Yeah, yes, she yeah, was the one. I loved that one. Yeah, I yeah that was, was the bunnies. really sweet. It was so cute. That it was, was really, really cute. cute. And I liked the pink contrast in the hood and then yeah. she had a different colour for the wrists and mm. waistband as well. Yeah. That was really clever. Um, so they had quite a tough task with the, the with the hoodies. That There were three different sort of areas, wasn't there? There was the, the, the sweatshirt material and then the lining, a different type of sweat for the lining of the yeah. hoods. And, and then, then obviously the, 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 the ribs and, um, and, the, and the waistband. No, yeah. I, I mean that's all new to me. I had no clue that, yeah. that they were different times. So I thought that was just a, the mm. same. So there were clearly a lot of skills that they were having to use. Yeah. And then of course the overlocker, the overlocker. Mm -hmm. and per Ben and his overlocker or not. Well, I, I've never used an overlocker. He, I have no he, idea. He of was it, that so. one child. <laughs> who will always do what he wants to do, <laughs> regardless. I was going to say, surely that was more in the next challenge. There was definitely a few that went, I'm doing it this way, and that's yeah. it. It's like, completely ignore the challenge. But I mean, the this pattern task, it was made more difficult than it was for a child, because yeah. trying to sew tiny armholes oh, and tiny... Mm. And yeah, getting a bit, much I mean, they had, you know, it's much easier on a bigger pattern as well. Yeah. Um, you know, if they were doing an adult hoodie, matching up You've got more up those, room for manoeuvre, really. Yeah. yeah. So, and, and the overlocker, um, when Stuart was texting me during the show, I was like, no, this is about an overlocker yeah. challenge. This yeah. isn't yeah. about making a hoodie. This, this is, is about can you use the equipment? Because that's what they were looking for. And as soon as Ben did, was I could understand because I would be the same. I'm, like, I'm not using that. I'm not yeah. using yeah, that. Yeah, that's too scary. It'd be fine because I'll just look after it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but if you're doing it for someone else, then it, the whole reason it needs to be overlocked is that jersey fabric will just pull and fray. Mm. Yeah. And the whole overlocking point is to lock all of that in yeah so that it can be washed over and over again you know when it gets all sweaty in the gym or whatever you yeah. do you know that's what you don't want it to fall covered. apart um and that i mean that's the technical side of yeah. it yeah and especially if it's a kid's garment it's going to get washed a lot yes because it's going to get mucky but yeah god love them i can understand because cutting off the material as you go <laughs> slightly petrified. yeah <laughs> and i know many people who come in the shop uh, often want lessons on the use of overlocking and and how to use it because it is a complicated machine i have no clue of it so um, yeah. i just run know. away arms feeling uh, no, I just don't know the machine. I've never, well, I've never made anything. You've got four needles, yeah. 
and two of the needles are going down right. with thread oh. yeah. and bizarrely the other two are coming across mm. and it's those two that lock in yeah. and lock down right. and that's what locks the, 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 the seam into the yeah. stitching that then stops it from fraying. So if you look at it, you can see where the, the interlock, okay. basically. So do you think Ben didn't know how to use the machine, or he actually just thought, I don't like using the machine? He actually just, said he didn't like using it. I the get the impression he's probably used it and sliced his work up, up and then yeah. thought, no, I'm not doing he that again. Never again. <laughs> yeah. He actually said he didn't yeah. like using them. Because that's yeah. what I'd do. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, I was fascinated with the whole history section because they used to obviously do that with the the, the Great British Bake Off, didn't they? Have a little section, yeah. yeah. But obviously, mm. I presume when it went to Channel Four, the timings. The, well, so they no, lost I mean, a lot of that element. To be fair to the Bake Off, for the first two or three series, they did the historical thing. But even when it was still on the BBC prime time, they kind of took that bit out. Yeah. Right? Um, but it was always nice because in the first series of the Bake Off, they went to like Bakewell and when they were in Bakewell they made Bakewell tarts yeah, yeah. and did the history of Bakewell. Yeah. So you know you've got to remember they toured around and, and did that. With all these different garments there is always going to be history to it so I just hope they keep putting interesting yeah, bits in Yeah I mean I'm fascinated like with it. I mean I, I used to remember the champion. Well they're still going. The big the woolly, the woolly jumpers yeah, and stuff yeah. and then they just switched over. I thought it was the history of it, of the, of the sport, and and then I think it was the father and son. Yeah, you know, and then the, the sportsman. They altered yeah. a woman's long yeah. sleeve t-shirt and came up with this. Found that fascinating. Yes. So, what about the um, the order then that they came on, on that hoodie challenge? This, we... this challenge wasn't a bad challenge. Ben was only criticised for not using the overlocker. Yeah. Mm. If you didn't look inside his, was his was yeah. fine as well. Yeah. They all did really did. well on that. It yeah. was hard to call. And, I and the bad. only one was the one, was it Sheila? Sheila. Her material she wasn't right. the wrong material. Yeah. 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 yeah, it was too flumpy. And also, oh God, love her, I felt bad because she used a contrasting colour mm. to stitch on yeah. the pocket. And it's like, it if you're going to draw but, attention to yeah. it, you know, mm. you want to be stitched stitch in perfect. a straight line. You have to be so perfect with something like that. Yeah. So yeah. I felt really bad for her. So it was, it you know, it was bad execution. So, and there was quite a few that didn't meet in the middle and stuff like that. Mm. Yes, yeah, so they, 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 they let Ricardo off because they were like, oh, you tried your hood on. And I'm like, but, you know, you still messed up. Yeah, because <laughs> if you tried it on. Yeah, you muppet. It's lovely little crop top. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> ridiculous. Yeah, entirely. But, you know, it's like, well. But, so, so we had, um, then obviously the winner was Janet of that round. Yes, mm -hmm. yeah. I think that's... Yeah. Actually, no, I quite right. like the shark one, but that oh, was because you, yeah. I like the shark one. Yeah. And I felt bad for Juliet. I love Juliet's material, which had the light yeah. bolts on, but yeah. that the, the hood was a mess. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Complete mess. Yeah. Um, yeah. Oh, okay. I did enjoy watching that, though, yeah. that pretty challenge. I did laugh. There was one thing I did laugh at was Alexi and his white cuffs and thing. And it's oh, like, yes, you're yeah. doing a kid's the garment. Contrast. How are you meant yeah. to? Yeah. You know? <laughs> and especially yeah, his white cuffs with a coloured top. If that runs. <laughs> yeah. They'll soon get anyway. dirty, won't they? Yeah. Okay, well, let's move on to the next um, part, which was the transformation challenge. Yes. Uh, that was great fun, wasn't yeah. it? So, what, the faux fur coat and yeah. uh, the idea of Sorry, turning it into blurred. like a, 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 a wild thing creature. or a mythical creature. And this is where you talk with the kids who decided to go yeah. off and do their own thing, and yeah. they had Mercedes with her princess yeah. sunshine. I just. And just who else? try and the talk through the logic of that. Do you think they are under pressure and then literally can't think or do they just want to come up with a different idea uh, and therefore move on from I the don't brief? think they I think the oh. instructions came right at the end and I think if I was in their position I'd have I'd have had my mind already working on what I wanted to make it is an unknown challenge so yeah. you know they have literally no That's idea they know they're going to have to transform something yeah. but they don't know what that something is yeah and um you know, as soon as they reveal it's a fur coat, I suppose in their heads they're already like, "Oh my god, what can I do?" Yeah. Yes, but they do. If you're, it's that kind of challenge. You need to listen to what they're hearing. <laughs> as a teacher, yeah, <laughs> listen to the instructions. instructions. Exactly. Yeah. And Mer Mercedes did say that at the end. Afterwards, she was like, "I don't know what I was thinking. I should have listened to what they told me and not gone yeah. off piece." Do you know what I mean? So yeah. she, she there, clearly there did also, hear. But went, "I'm going this." There was an opportunity because they were telling them what they had to do. They went, "Oh, you're going to be working with this," but then when they said, "Oh," 
Um, they're under that sheet over there, so they hadn't even yeah. seen what fur coats no, were under there. Exactly. So even then, they should have still been listening because they could have pulled them off. They could have all been lurid yellow fur. Yeah. I mean, they had a bright blue and a pink one, I think, didn't they? Yeah. And then they had the, the leopard print and everything else. Yeah. yeah. But you didn't know what you were going to get, even. Exactly. But that's the thing. Sure, Juliet did actually end up with the yellow one. Yeah. So she could have. There are lots of monsters she could have done yeah. or something like that. But she was like. Mm-hmm. Well, and the people who who did it really well were the ones who went for it. Yeah. We had like the dinosaurs. Yeah. And yes, the, that was awesome. It's a yeah. shame he didn't get that finished because we're yeah. still pins. Yeah. And yeah. I absolutely love Jens. I and think I do, she should have I do just, one. you know, like, it does annoy me a bit when the judges go, they went and said, oh, this has got pins in. You're making this for a child. Yes, if I was making it for a child, I wouldn't do it in two hours and leave a load of pins in. I'd spend an extra 10 minutes to sew the ears on. Yeah, exactly. You know, it is kind of like, well, you want to see what we want to do, but, you know. Yeah, you don't have very much time yeah. to it. Yeah, it wasn't like they were going on children there and then to go and play outside. <laughs> Like the um, last <laughs> yeah. section yeah. where they were going. Yeah. Sure. yeah, yeah, that's but, definitely one of. But you know, it. that's the trouble with that. It's like, well, they don't know what they're doing. They're trying to make up as they go along. They yeah. are trying to be a bit more adventurous in places. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes, we have to know that they haven't quite finished it in the time, but to then say, well, you wouldn't have this if this was going on. No, we wouldn't. Yeah, we're not, you'd finish it. We're not stupid. You'd take an extra few minutes. And I wouldn't, I wouldn't say to myself, I'm going to get up this morning and try and do something in two hours. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'd take the whole, whole day to do it. <laughs> exactly, and do it right. But to me, I was a wee bit disappointed. So, um, who was at one with that one? Oh, Ben. Ben, oh, no, ben went cool. from top to bottom. Yeah. Didn't he? Yeah. Then, uh, oh, sorry, the other yeah, way around. This was the ant with his bone But he yeah. he knew what he, I mean, because I didn't realise he, he was a veterinary cost- student. Yes, and, and he was a costume also, designer as well. Yeah, yeah, but he saw that fur coat and could see that abdomen oh, and yeah. thorax of yeah. an ant. Yeah. I look at you with your fancy work. <laughs> <laughs> and, 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 you know, he was on that boning and then created all of that. So that yeah. And the fabric did all the work. Because once it was sat, he didn't really do anything. It sat on that boning. Yeah, and, it and that just, was it. And, it and he did, he the did do the, the legs, the extra legs, yeah. to make sure it was anatomically correct. Oh, yeah, but what I mean is with the fur, he literally just wrapped yeah. it around there, whereas yeah. others were cutting and slicing and everything yeah. like that. Well, I, that's why I thought, Jen, that was so much effort. And she got yeah. that finished, and it was just, I loved hers. I, the cape with all the The one I wanted, which I think... I think the head was that one. Was it? It wasn't a fantastic. Sorry. Was I it? just dropped her needle. I dropped my needle. Was it Alexi who did the bursting out of the t-shirt? Yeah. yeah. I wanted that to look better than what it did. Yeah. yeah In my head, I that. could see what he was seeing, and then when it was kind of done, I was like. Mm. Not quite executed, but it just felt like it was I missing it, something. I wanted it. Yeah. I, I knew what he wanted to achieve, and yeah. therefore I was I was rooting for him for that yeah. one. And I see. Um, Leah's was quite no. Hers was just like the cat ears and the cape with an S on Who was it who went mad with the haberdashery? That was Sheila again, God love her. Yeah. She put everything on Because the thing is, that. that would be me. I'd panic and then just get the hot glue gun <laughs> and cover it with feathers and buttons and sequins. <laughs> but the whole object is sewing glue gun. Well, that's because it's not what um, they were saying with Juliet. She... Yeah glued on her stripes and she was like well yeah. I don't have time I yeah. like, that would have been you just do as much as you can and pin the rest as you say yeah. you know to demonstrate yeah. skill but she just glued it all on mm-hmm. um, but yeah I was a bit but again I, really I mean there the was no I mean well. yeah they were all quite good um, yeah. the ones in the bottom fails because they hadn't followed the brief yeah if you take the brief out then actually what they made was okay yeah but that's why they were in the bottom they deserve to be in the bottom yeah but again for something where they didn't know what they were going to make yeah there was some really good stuff there yeah, they yeah. Were re- really whereas really i impressed. still would be at that table now going i don't know what i'm going to do <laughs> somebody <laughs> can, give me a pattern can i make a fur coat <laughs> <laughs> and that's, uh, one thing I was laughing as well. I was like, clearly yeah. none of them knew how yeah. to work, how that material was going to work either. Because no. Ricardo said that he was like, I have no idea how this works. I've never worked with this yeah, material before. So that was quite fun, just to see them be like, ah, I'm just going to cut it all up and see what happens. It is a bit like because putting it again, putting it through the sewing machine. I know. Do, working with some costumes before, where we've yeah. had things like that, there is a question on whether you should, in effect shave the fur where the hem is going to be so you can fit it through oh yeah of course you know or at least yeah, cut it back so that you can feed it through the sewing yeah, machine yeah some of them were just like my machine is now full of fur <laughs> so it's just yeah. fluff balls everywhere which was a bit hard i'd say are they their machines or are they the machines no, of the, the show, show i'm not the sure show's machines i oh, know the, the show's yeah. machines because they're all exactly they're all the, the same, same. Yeah. Uh, Okay, because that, that adds rubbish. in another element of yeah. uncertainty because you're used yeah. to your own machine. Yeah, yeah, yeah especially because like, I know me, what to do with my machine. Yeah, when it's it like I have a really old I singer, and it's like if I sat down with a more modern machine, I'd be like, so what is happening here? There's lots of buttons. 
Yeah. So yeah. Although next fun. week looks fun because it's seventies week and they've given them seventies machines, haven't they? Oh. Did you see the clip for <laughs> next week? Yeah. 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 I'd probably be fine with one of those. I've got a quite an old machine. But yeah. I can remember my my mum having my grandmother's machine but it was a handle machine mm-hmm. uh-huh. and the thought of having to turn that handle and guide the fact i don't i don't think i could do that one handed no it's actually you're in more control because i used to have <laughs> i'm that old um you're in what you've got more control over what slower. you're doing because it's, it's slower, slower. Yeah. yeah it is slower um, you don't get all the fancy stitches on them. Well, yeah. no. It's just a straight but, stitch, isn't um, it? Yeah, you just get the straight stitch. And the one I, I actually inherited from a, a lady was 100 years old when I inherited it. Mm. Oh, wow. So, but don't know where it is now. Oh. But, yeah, no. But yeah, it'll, that, it'll be interesting that would be to a nightmare to have to go back to, to hand-cranking the machine. Yeah. <laughs> but I, I, I remember my parents using it to make curtains and things with mm. I mean, they didn't happen very often because of the time. Because, yeah, yeah. So yeah. Takes I mean, now, so when I can sit there and go, woof, woof, and it's through, he, yeah. he, he yeah. does it so quickly. So what do we think? So on the final day, they had their... The, the, the major measure. Yeah. Mm-hmm. The dance so what did we think? Because dance, I know for a fact, because being a dancer, for, it's really hard to make a good dance costume that moves with your arms yeah. and everything else. I noticed most like, of them were all leotards minus arms. It was to work with stretch fabric again, yeah. though, wasn't it? Because yeah. the hoodie yeah. was but that. some of them didn't work, and I was really impressed with those that didn't work with stretch fabric, because if you get that wrong and you have arms yeah. that move, yeah. it's a nightmare. Yeah. Um, so, like Jen and stuff. But again, you know, Ben spent so long making that fabric. And oh. do you know what? I admire him for it because I know what he was trying to achieve yes but this is again we I think we said this last week when we talked about um the guy that went out last week mm-hmm. yeah this is something you would have practiced so if you can't make that fabric in, in a couple of hours yeah because then the you know the fabric did work well and when it stretched you could see the black the fabric underneath yeah. but then he'd left no time to do the skirt and the arms yeah. and it was just a bit of net that looked like yeah. it had been stapled up yeah. basically yeah, I was really underwhelmed by his outfit like the bodice fabulous but the outfit overall it was just like it's half done he had this yeah. lovely neck collar and he had one sleeve done and a bit of wafty netting behind her and I was like oh that's a bit disappointing he, mm. he was trying to play to his strengths yeah but he he made it m- more complicated than he yeah. needed to over yeah. maybe having some of his own made fabric rather than the whole garment. Yeah, he could have just done the front maybe yeah. or a section of it. But, yeah. 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 But I mean, he's tr- he's he's trying because you got to remember last week he's the one that had dyed his own fabric. Yeah. This week he made his own he's, fabric. He's real try hard. He's got that, <laughs> but he's obviously got those skills to be able to yeah. do that. Yeah. But I, would, I would to, not have the patience to do. But he needs to make sure he has those skills in the time that's allotted. Yeah. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It's like yeah. if if you're going to demonstrate it as like do a panel do a yeah. section of yeah. it with like the top because that would have been effective or just even the just, top half. just or even just the front of the leotard yeah. he'd done the whole thing he could yeah. have just done the front, front yeah and then just but done a black yeah. I think it's time to practice though this that's yeah. so yeah. Yeah. I, I, that's a bit frustrating in a way isn't it yeah so that he just didn't mm. is it that, well is it him just thinking oh I will have time or I will but again, don't if I just suddenly if I practiced at home on my own in my sewing room I'd Is probably do it in four hours. Yeah. But yeah. then suddenly yes. you've got people coming around interviewing you, you've got someone yeah. else over there having a crisis and you're trying to see what's going on with them. Distracted. And, and you've actually got to fit it to a live model yeah. where at home yeah. you might just be using a dummy. Yeah. So, you know, it, it it just, you've done it at home and think, oh yeah, I can do that. Yeah. And you're also using somebody else's machine. Yeah. You're in a completely yeah. different yeah. environment. But did we think the same, the same as well with Sheila? So she was another person, God love her, she was already having a bad week and she decided she was going to make a reverse outfit. And oh, that's the oh. thing though, isn't it? Once oh, you man. start having a bad week, oh, I would have just... got to that end challenge and gone, do you know what? I'm not going to tell anyone I was going to make a reversible no, jacket. I'm just, just going to sit just... there. But no, she was like, I'm going to make this reversible. And then you can see everyone going, Sheila, really? Yeah. Sheila, yeah. <laughs> think what's happened over the last two challenges. But do you yeah. think she tried doing it during the week at home? Well, Again, I think done. she's probably done it. You know, like we said right. with Ben, you, she, you wouldn't say it if you couldn't, couldn't do, do it. it yeah and clearly she was like as you say but she I mean home. poor poor woman I uh, felt for her because she cut a fabric roll I know. and then she put, oh, tried to patch yeah. it up oh, yeah. all done without doing the other side because she had done two <laughs> left sides that's she? Yeah. Isn't it? But that's the time well, running again, out and then you put the if ruler if you were at home place. well if I was at day. home it would have been screwed up in a ball and thrown in the corner but but if you were at home you would stop you would go to the shop and buy some more fabric and you do it where she was just like 
oh my god, I need to patch this. And as soon as mm. she said that, you're like, no, don't, don't patch it, Sheila. Don't, yeah. don't patch but, it. But I thought yeah. she did. She did really well to him. She just like, needed to put it on the other, on the other side. side. That yeah. would have been perfect. Like mm. Patrick said as much. She's like, if you'd done that the other side, we would not have known any different. No. So that I was suppose when you're thing. under pressure, you don't, you don't. You don't think. think. Yeah. yeah you're too busy going. TV. That looks okay. Let's go. Because the rest of it looked quite well. Like she did the cuffs really well, yeah. and she had a nice collar, and everything looked. And it really did balanced. move when the when the child had got yeah. it on. It yeah. moved well. Yeah. yeah. And my favourite one of that was the Scottish. Yeah, oh, well, it was so fabulous. That, that, was, that was yeah. absolutely got my beautiful. Eye on her. That's why we were talking. It's like there's no stretch with that, and that looked really nice. Although, it was such a shame with the sleeve. <laughs> but again, but you know, if you were at home, yeah. you just, just put another bit of elastic. Yeah. 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 yeah, but the elastic had gone at that point. But it was a bit like um, I think it was Sheila last week, wasn't it? Although it was because it didn't fit. <laughs> But she, when she did the zip and then the zip bust, <gasps> yes. and if it happens when someone's going, you've got two minutes. There's nothing you can do yeah, about no. it. And it was the same with her with the sleeve. She'd put it onto the model, and as she was pulling it on, it went, right, and it was yeah. like, I've got two minutes. I can't. Mm. You're done. Take it out and, and and redo it. Yeah. And so who else did we think? There was another outfit, and I thought um, it was just a really a bit plain. The the, well, I the thought that was one. Myself, I thought. I mean, but then it was. Plain but very, very, very well executed. It was incredibly but well executed to have that plain, down though. center. Yeah. yeah, but it was yeah, but the it was center the down, center yeah. down. Yeah. It was also center down here, center down the bit that joined yeah. with the, mm-hmm. and that matched up, and everything was just so clean. What do you done. think about that's um, an easy when you could Esme's just have a point about the the feathers though, because well, they were see, I, different uh, colors. Yeah. It was I, Patrick you, who didn't like them. I, I hadn't picked up on the fact that there were feathers on the skirt initially because mm-hmm. it blended so oh, well. Yeah. They were really nice. So when it then went into a close up and I saw there were black and white feathers, I did kind of then go, well, if you had black and white, why did you put grey? See, I yeah. like yeah. the grey. For me, it really liked. No, but if I had I black did. and white, I would have put them on. But I quite liked I liked the I introduction like of another gray. colour because it's the fact that it's two colours mixed. So the but black and white mixed point, you would have gone grey. It was the white one and the black mm. one. And but to me, I saw grey as the the down on a baby swan. On a baby swan, yeah, which yeah. Is not but what it's it for was. a kid as well. Though. Yeah, but it's not what it was, was it? It was the two adult swans. Yeah. I really liked it. It just because otherwise it's just black and, white and black and white and black Should've and white. Should have gone black and white yeah. feathers. Oh, I see. I liked the grey because I liked another colour and it's also a slightly different texture than the full on feathers because they were a bit more fluffy and it was just a nice bit of flump. On the mm-hmm. shoulders. Have you talked so about Alexi's moth? No. You know, from Miss Not the one you wanted to no, flat with. I really liked it though. So. Yeah. No, I did. I liked oh, it. I, I just it. don't know whether it, it missed looked a bit something. brown. <laughs> yes, could it have been a bit more. But it didn't. You on, can, the, on the dress bit but there. That was the whole point. It was supposed to be wafty rather well, than yes. fluffy. Yeah. And I quite liked it. And it's just. And I suppose it's a moth as well. You didn't really it? get. We didn't get a good look at the skirt, which kind of annoyed me because no. when they were doing the, you know, you basically seen the bodice and a wee bit of yeah. the skirt. There was loads of lures on that skirt. Mm. And yeah. if the child had a sword, and yeah. it was also it was attached to the yeah. wrists. Yeah. Yeah. So it had it yeah, had yeah. more to it. I was like, you didn't really get to see it, which was a wee bit. You know, mm. that's the way it was cut. But I quite liked but it. But is that mm. because they were happy with how it was made and they wanted Probably. to focus on? Yeah. Yeah. The they, they were like, that's really good. Yeah. High fives. Move on. Yeah. Yeah. So, but I quite liked his, especially because I wish I wanted to see her do more of this with the arms and stuff. <laughs> Let me just poke your eyes out. Sorry about that. I mean, yeah. I do think. I mean, I, I know we said about Jen's; it was very well made. But yeah. then I also think Ricardo's was of a similar vein because it was yes. that, that yeah. Tarantella yeah. dress. Mm. But I thought that was well made. Yes, yeah. but it was really simply done. I would like. To but then there was an more. argument that that Jen's was relatively. It was. A, I know she had the waistcoat. Yeah, and the lacy, and, and the she lacy had the, the piping. But. You know. But surely there are. She had lots of wee extra details. Mm. Whereas his was just plain, plain, plain. Yeah. But there's still more skills there than Leah's leotard, wasn't there? Don't you think? Yeah, but Leah's he leotard was really the precision. And and that stretch material that she's working yeah. with as well. If you'd have looked at Leah right. and that seam and had gone like oh, that, did, <laughs> yes. But you could argue yeah. it was only that seam, whereas the others, like Ricardo, no, there are more. There are more skills. Well, no, because she shown. also did the tulle and she also did the feathers, and you know what I mean. There was more. To, whereas his was all the same fabric. Because there was no stretch and, material, and there was nothing, and it was she would it have was designed just basic, that, basic, basic. Whereas he copied a Tarantella yeah, dress. Yeah, yeah. Yes, it's those she cultural references. And if you're it? stitching yeah. with something that's stretch and that moves, and you're trying to hit a really straight line. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Do you know yeah. what I mean? So I there was more. Whether, oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! I suppose yes, it's a big skill. Um, does that weigh up more than perhaps three or four mm. other skills? Yeah, maybe? I don't know because I, I his skirt was great, but it looked wonky for me. I looked at his skirt and I was like. That doesn't look like it would sit right whenever you go. It feels like it missed a bit of weighting around the bottom of it. it but then it was a fidgy. child's dancey dress, so you want it yeah, to Yeah, but it's a dancey dress. Up, don't it's you? A, yeah, exactly. So that's where you need the weighting to get that, because otherwise mm. it's just it's floaty and it won't lift. Yeah. It won't. Yeah. So you need something around the bottom to add that extra weighting to lift it. 
so when you spin it's going to come up really nicely mm. whereas otherwise it's just a bit flumpy and a bit fluty so what about switches. Juliet's skirt then because she did the the layers and the netting in between have you talked about that how 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 do you feel about that I doing, loved her skirt yeah she had the I layers and the, the 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 what did she have the netting in between yeah she yeah. had netting in between yeah. See, the I layers of I didn't like it Oh, I the whole out. I just didn't like the whole outfit. Oh, that was, that is the right one I'm thinking about. It was like the pinky purpley. Yeah, yeah, the and the rooster top. Yeah, and, and I just thought that was awful. Oh, oh I thank love. You. I hated it. Oh, I can just imagine because especially because the like whole outfit. No, I didn't what did like you not it. like about it? I didn't like. I didn't like the shape of it. You know, like you often talk about the silhouette. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's what they talk about on other programs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but that to me, it looked like. It looked like one of them. If you if it was a silhouette, it looked like an ink spot. It just kind of went. But that was the whole point. It's one of those like yeah, when they're dancing. I, I to felt the... that it was made for the wrong age of yes, child. Yes, possibly. I think it was yeah. more for a teenager. But I also just thought no, because that's why because I it was just so crunched in as well. I, just, mm. I it felt like yes, you wanted to go that didn't... with it and yeah. just yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I think it needed somebody who. I mean, the skill was there. Especially, it's one of these outfits. It's not like a. And like this kind of one, it's one of these. Oh yeah, kind of yeah. 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 But and I, think I didn't like it. Well. I didn't oh, like I it. I loved it. That was one of my favourites. I can appreciate I it, it, but I didn't like and it. And I didn't agree with Patrick. He was like, "There's too much here," and I said, "No, you've got a kid. You want to make sure you're covering a lot of them, and you want to have that runch. So when they're doing no, that, I think what he meant was there's too much fabric going yeah, it round. Was, there was it a was, lot of fabric there, and it hadn't been gathered very well, in my opinion. Yeah. yeah. Well, I quite know. See, for me, I really liked it because. For me, it's like I mean, if that kid's moving and stretching day, and doing that, yeah. Yeah. you kind of want to make sure it's covered as much as possible while still being rushy. Mm. So, but that's, well, that's the beauty me. of having these chats, isn't it? You then get to see mm. where people's yeah. opinions are, mm. and people obviously like different things, don't yeah. they? What about? Did you talk about Janet's hornpipe? Yeah, because that was sort of. I yeah, classic, I wasn't really bothered simple. with hers at all. But that's it exactly was it. Simple. It was simple. Yeah, yeah. yeah. but there yeah. was. But it worked though, didn't it? Yeah, it did. you, know, you can imagine. But it also show wasn't and a whole chorus line. It didn't, you know, like yeah. we were saying with Jens, where you were saying about the piping and the, everything like that. Yeah, those had those extra details on mm. where she just did. It was simple. What do you call it? And um, um, and one gets the impression that she's probably made that for her grandchildren. Yeah, three or four times. Yeah, yeah. So oh, yeah. it wasn't yeah. much of a challenge yeah. for her. But then, I suppose if you make a really good Victoria sponge, you're going to make that, yeah. aren't you? Yeah, you are. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> well, but is, that's the whole point of the show, though, isn't yeah. it? To yeah. play to your strengths. Yes. Yeah, but there was no umph about it. It was all just like... It's very traditional. Yeah. I must say... Yeah, but Jen's was traditional, and that looked stunning. It did, didn't it? That just, yeah. I was like, oh, wow. I Whereas did think, hers, though, I was like, that mm. this whole week was, for me, a little bit underwhelming. It wasn't, mm. it wasn't like mm. last week, where it was kind of like, oh what's going to happen next that they you know they all did really good hoodies they, that's the thing. they, they all did all, reasonably all really good, good. For, yeah. for, uh, not that I want people to go wrong but there was also nothing that okay, really yeah. stood out yeah, yeah well she listed Whereas, and how badly she went wrong god love her well yes but that was for the wrong reason but like yeah. last last week you know Juliet and Ben's wiggle dress you know they really stood out and yeah. the the denim skirt really stood out um, Alexi's skirt and things think like that. that but there was nothing that really stood out well for me Jen's um, fancy dress I was just stunned with that. The bird. Yeah, that, yeah. Was, that, that was for me. Creative. I was like, wow. Yeah. That's serious. I thought that was really impressive. That was for me. I was like, oh wow. But I also like quite liked some of the outfits and stuff. But I, I'm, I want to be more impressed. You want next to be? Week. Over, I think that will. I think, a bit, yeah. <laughs> I think that will come the harder the challenges get. because so, yeah. I think people will then really will stand out. I think the other thing really with children well though is that the garments are small. When you see yeah. a model. In a full length, like I think they said next week, with it being seventy centimeters of a maxi dress. Yeah. You know the way that fabric hangs and everything. You don't get that on a small child. No. And we've just been talking about the way the other one was. We thought was too yeah. much fabric. Yeah. Whereas on a on a model where you can see the pattern, you can see the way it hangs and it mm. drapes. Yeah. That's when you can kind of go. That is really Stunning. good. Yeah. And you can make where I didn't feel you could put much between people were in the bottom here because they didn't follow the instructions, Briefs, not yeah. because. They were awful. No, that's right. No. Yeah. Well, Sheila's... God, I, I, I know I love the woman, but she had a... Her stuff wasn't great. Well, she ultimately went, didn't she? Yeah. So what do we think about that? Do we agree? Yeah. 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 Very yeah. much so. Yeah. No controversy. No, show. not no, at all. No, not at all. No. Um, and then uh, Leah got Garment of the Week. I don't think that deserved garment. I no, wanted I Jen's bird outfit to be I, garment I, of the week. I think, so, <laughs> but I think yeah. that reflects what we've just said, yeah. is that yeah. there was nothing yeah. that really, really stood yeah. out, yeah. nothing that used an exceptional yeah. set of skills. And and it's not because one was really bad. Or, they were all really quite yeah. good. To try and choose 
yeah. one is quite hard actually. Yeah, because this week it was all about the detail. Because if you're dealing with small people, you have to be really good in your detail mm -hmm. yeah. and really fine. So, so who to watch out for next week then? <gasps> I want to see more of Jen. I love Jen. I've decided I want her to win. <laughs> so <you're> on... <laughs> That's so what I'm there's doing. two of us now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. We've so decided Jen should win. Well, and I said that she's probably likely to win because of the editing. Who's your, who is now your favourite? Mine is now Jen, obviously. Well, my, I said Jen last week, so still I'm still sticking, sticking with, with Jen. Yeah. I still yeah. haven't... I mean, I said that I'd quite like to see another man win, and then yeah. unfortunately... <laughs> After watching this week, I was like, mm, I none don't think that's going to happen. Yeah, none his, of the men have been really... It wasn't his Megan that put you off then, was it? <laughs> I, don't know. I, don't know. I reckon if Ben brings it down a notch and actually gets in, he could do a lot more. Yeah. And yeah. Alexi is sometimes... He's sometimes really good and sometimes a bit from mm. And Ricardo's just all over the shop. You're yeah. never quite Andy, sure. what about you? What do you think? Have you got a favourite? I'd like to see... I think Ben has potential to go yeah. far if he listens to what he's being asked to do yeah. mm. and actually thinks about what he's doing a little bit more. Yeah, and I mean, he would, he, he would have had an exceptional week if he'd just used the overlocker. Yeah. Because yeah. there was nothing wrong with his hoodie. Yeah. It just no. wasn't overlocked. It was actually beautiful. It was. If you, if you were looking at it purely from the front, yeah. that would have been one of the ones I would have gone, yeah. Yeah. It was it's beautiful. Yeah. So, yeah, Ben. So, it's 70s week next week. Excited about it? Yes. Um, yeah. Oh, I love a bit of vintage. I'm hoping there's going to be some nice flares on there that I can actually copy upon. Did I tell you I've inherited some cords? But that's a whole other story. Oh, I want to make myself some nice flared cords. Now, <laughs> I'm be watching. I presume they're using the machines. Is that right? Because I'm not familiar yeah. with the whole format. Will they? Will they put them in 70s completely? Yes. It looked yes. like from the clip like it. that it was yeah. 70s machines. Right. Okay. Yeah. As we were, we were having a conversation about sewing machines, you missed out. Ah, yeah. yeah. uh, right. But yeah. 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 Um, well, that's going to be interesting. I'd, using I'd like I'd like to see some um, vintage dresses. Excuse oh, you're telling me that. That's on camera. Yeah, some more of it because we had the wig dress in week one. Vintage I think dresses they did. The did they not say yeah. it was a maxi dress? Is yeah, the challenge? I think so. So then it's whether it's what the it's what the um, alteration challenge would be because mm -hmm. are they going to use vintage? Clothes that need to be altered. Oh, they'd have to. Oh, yeah. They're all the really flammable or stuff. Or make a, <laughs> Or have they got to make something <laughs> in the style of the yeah. 70s? Yeah, in the style yeah. of. I think they have I, to use I, the fabric as well because that stuff I, was. I think the fabric. If you're the flammable flammability, they won't be allowed to use oh, it. That's true. For health they and They could safety. pull that sheet off and it'd just be a row of wincy at 90s. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but it could be all the dodgy shell suits and all those yes. No, things. wrong decade. Wrong decade. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> so wincy at 90s and halter neck dresses and. Sorry, I am that old. I remember it well. Yeah. I wasn't even born. They haven't done anything for a man Sorry. yet, though, although I don't think there's anything that iconic from the 70s for oh, a man. Um, oh, come on. Let's hear it. Yeah. There but we haven't be. had a man's because so, like, we've done shirts and ties and things yeah. in the past. So so you've got the big wing collars. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. From yeah, the from the men on a shirt. A shirt, nice fitted shirt. Yeah, flares. Yeah, yeah. I really want to see some flares, people. I want ideas for flares. So I'm just biased. <laughs> I want flares. We'll be watching Tuesday night, won't yes. we? Yes. Yeah. Pinging a few messages on the old WhatsApp group. <laughs> we need to, we need to organise that just to um, take it all. <laughs> yeah, and hope you're enjoying it as much as we are. And we'll be back talking about who will go. Unfortunately, mm. I won't be back next week. Oh, you week. That's just rude. I'm 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 at Fakenham Racecourse oh, well. for the weekend. Oh. We'll, we'll have a jolly. cardboard cut out with you. Yeah. <laughs> you well, and we're on our adventures next week. Oh, well. Yes. So we'll have to yeah, we're off early. to uh, the Knitting and Stitch show in Olympia, aren't we? Mm -hmm. <gasps> yeah. Jealous. Weekend down there. So that'd be great. Nice. Yeah. Okay. Well, awesome. Uh, yeah. Thank you very much for watching. And uh, speak to you and see you all soon. Yeah. Don't forget to like and subscribe and leave all the comments. Thank you. Bye. 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 Bye.